And now let's welcome in the new head coach of the Seattle Seahawks, Mike McDonald. Thanks for spending time with us, Coach. You just got a chance uh, to welcome Byron in. His family's there. You've been a part of this league for a little while now, Coach. Uh, how special does it feel to be the head coach to change a family's life like that? Yeah, that, that was really neat. And try to put yourself in their shoes and all the work and um, just the time time on task throughout his entire life and just really proud for Byron and his family that they can have that moment and share it together. So uh, really excited for him. And uh, you can tell they've done such a great job with him, raising him the right way. And he's, uh, he's a great young man, but we're excited to make him a Seahawk. And, and he comes in with a part of this rest of this 2024 group, a whirlwind coach. You come in, you take the job, build a staff, you go through the draft prep, and now you've got a little bit of time. How do you feel about the draft class? <laughs> Yeah, we're really excited about the class. A lot of guys, you know, we're excited that they were able to fall to us and, and, and be, in a board, be on the board where uh, we were in a position to, to take them. And um, I, think, uh, I think we met a lot of needs with a combination of bringing in the right type of guys, uh, right type of play style for us. And uh, we're excited to, to make them part of the team. And now, we, now all the work that we get to look forward to with camp coming in and for the next couple of days. And then when they join the team with the rest of the vets, we'll have a, you know, a great offseason for, you know, for the rest of the spring. Coach, is there a point of emphasis in what's going to be the 2024 Seahawks defense? What do you mainly want to focus on? Yeah, you know, I, we, we're actually taking our time with our install, and I think, I think we're trying to get everybody on the same page to build the, you know, the proper foundation so everyone has a shared understanding of how we want to play. Um, just play the game, play the techniques, build the fundamentals, build, you know, build a sound foundation, and then you know, the install will take care of itself. But right now, you know, just really excited about the connection we have between our coaches and our players. And uh, this will be something that we'll be able to fall back on, you know, as we start to build this thing over the course of the season. And looking at the, the draft class, uh, I know you and, and John Schneider uh, at the draft said that the ages of the guys wasn't necessarily a, a goal for you. It's more of a result of the COVID year. How do you feel these guys are coming in uh, that have been impacted by that COVID year? Yeah, it's interesting with the, with the, uh, with the ages, it gets such a big variance now. I mean, there's some guys in the class that are 21, some guys upwards of 24, you know, that might even be 25. I'm not talking about the, the whole draft class, but uh, yeah, I think, you know, the COVID, the COVID kind of influence is interesting. Guys that have been extra years, I think NIL plays a lot of a big part of that. Uh, maybe another, another year to mature and, and, and grow as a, as a young person. But uh, yeah, like, like you said, it wasn't a huge part of what we were a part of our equation. But you're always going to take age into account, and we're, we're excited that uh, we got the right type of guy joining our team. And the new guys coming in have the benefit of a 33-year-old quarterback who's been through a lot in the league. Uh, how's Geno been a part yeah. uh, of this acclimation to the, to the new uh, Mike McDonald Seattle Seahawks? Yeah, geno has been great. He's been great. I mean, he's, you know, they spent a lot of time outside the facility with some of the offensive guys and um, just feeling a lot of buy-in, and we're trying to empower him you know, to really take, take the reins of the offense and the team. And... Uh, I think he's taking the bull by the horns and, and asking everything, you know, or doing everything that we're asking him to do. But uh, he's, had a, he's had a great first couple of weeks. And, uh, you know, it's the start of this. So, you know, it's a process, and we'll take it uh, slow as smooth and smooth as fast, and uh, we'll build it the right way. But Gino's right at, the, right at the tip of the spear. And a part of the process in building the, the new Seattle Seahawks, uh, of course, making some changes around the facility there in Renton. What, what's the main <laughs> goal when you say that you want to develop your own stuff, your own new era, uh, where does that begin and how do you go about it? Yeah, with the, with the messaging with the guys, I think, I think the biggest thing that we're shooting for is, is consensus and making it our own. So, uh, you know, there's certain things and certain, certain sayings that I've brought to the table and brought to the guys, and um, I think it's starting to resonate with them. But I also wanted to make it our own. I want to have their impact, you know, so we're together on these things and now – you know, when we kind of, you know, when there's adversity hits, there's things that we can rely on that we decided that, uh, you know, this is how we're going to operate together. And uh, that's, that's, that's what we're shooting for. And uh, I think it's all start to kind of come into play here once we get everybody in the building, you know, through camp. And uh, it'll be fun, it'll be fun to, to build it, you know, together with the rest of the guys on the team. Well, looking forward, Coach McDonald, to seeing how you build. I saw the, the social team uh, built your LinkedIn profile, but then I, I go and check. And, and we got to get it actually updated and not just not just for social media, coach, because it, it's important this time of year. But there it is. The head coach of the Seattle Seahawks. OK, I do have a LinkedIn. All right. That's good. Yeah, that's, you've got one. It's, it's, it's actually there. I, looked at. Okay. I, I had to go check. I, I had no choice. So it was a great tweet by them. Uh, looking forward to seeing what you guys accomplish here in 2024. Thanks for joining us on Total Access.
Uh, yeah, I appreciate it. Thank you for your time. That was awesome.